The Hard Truth Season 8 with Akosia Konedu. Proudly brought to you by Echo Bank. Today, we are talking about Ecobank Ghana, uh, the pioneers of modern corporate banking in the country, which has grown to become the largest bank in Ghana. Ecobank is number one in terms of revenues, total assets, uh, deposits, and profitability, and it's an important subsidiary of the Ecobank Group, which has the biggest uh, footprint in sub Saharan Africa. My name is Nana Akosia Kunedu, and this is the hard truth and we are currently at the Echo Bank head office for Ghana and uh, we'll be right back. My name is Nana Akosia Knedu and Mrs. Uh, Reverend, sorry, Mrs. Patricia Sapo, head of uh, corporate communications, Echo Bank Ghana, is my guest. Patricia, how are you? Very well. Thank you. Right. Welcome to the hard truth. Thank you. You're looking well. <laughs> yes. Thank God. Now, let's look at um, Ecobank. And uh, for those of us who don't really have any idea of Ecobank and how it started, give us a brief history of how the whole thing started. Well, Ecobank in the year 1983, the Federation of um, West Africa Chamber of Commerce told us expedient to have a financial institution that will facilitate trade mm -hmm. you know, um, across West Africa. Mm -hmm. So in 1985, our um, holding company, you know, was set up that is Ecobank Transnational Incorporated. Mm -hmm. Was it just up. West Africa or the whole of Africa? Africa. The whole of yeah. Africa. Yes. So ETI, so to say, was set up in 1985. Mm -hmm. And then in 1990, Ecobank Ghana was set up. Mm -hmm. To 25 yeah. years now? Yes, 25 years. What, what are the mission, I mean, the mission and vision of every uh, company? It's, it's like a, a conch thing or it's, it's, it's like a static thing the company looks out to. What is the mission and vision of the bank, Ecobank? Well, definitely we are being driven by a mission and a vision. Right. And our vision is to build a world-class, you know, um, pan-African institu banking institution mm. to contribute to the development of, of Africa mm. and also the financial integration of Africa. Mm. Yes. So, so do you think in your company, from what you said, to contribute to the development of Africa? So are you contributing to Africa? Oh, yes, we are contributing to Africa in diverse ways. Like in which ways? Diverse maybe? ways. Um, First of all, we are facilitating trade, you know, across Africa. Right. It's very easy. We are in 36 countries. So wherever anybody wants to transact business across Africa, it's a lot easier. Mm. You know, we, we, we have employed people. We have a lot of people, over 14,000, you know, staff members oh. across Africa. I mean, that's quite a good number, mm. you know. And then also, in so many ways, we have also provided corporate social responsibility, you know, um, um, contributed to various institutions and NGOs that require support from us. Any institution yeah. would recall some very huge successes, you know, they achieved, I mean, along the line. What would you say the success story of Ecobank is? Ecobank it's, Ghana. It's, it's, it's quite a lot. You know, we started from a very humble beginning. We just one branch, mm. and as I where speak, was the branch? Just in the head of us here. Yeah. Yes, mm. yes, yes. And now we are we have seventy nine branches, mm -hmm. you know, and, and that's it's a feather in our cap. Mm. We have one hundred and ninety five ATMs, you know, across, mm. and um, we have our visa cards, you know, that can be used anywhere. You see any visa branded ATM or POS. You know, we have um, the visa cards also mm. available. Mm. Um, 
Also, we are the largest bank in Ghana. They know that after taking over <laughs> Trust Bank, that, that was a very good move. But eight, eight regions, why not 10? Why not 10 regions? I mean, it's, it's a gradual process. Mm. It's a gradual process. Mm. But I mean, just before I talk about that, I just want to, you mentioned about our mission. Right. You know, and um, all these things are in line with our mission, which is to provide our customers with services that are convenient, accessible, reliable and easy to use, mm. you know, because, I mean, it's all about convenience. It's all about making sure that the customer gets what he or she wants and getting it at the right time, mm. you know. So um, that is the mission. Right. So tell me, why not 10 regions? Why just 8 <laughs> regions? <laughs> I mean, I mean we, it's, it's, it's a process. I believe that we'll get there very soon. Mm. Let's talk about awards. How many awards do you have so far, Kobangana? Oh, we have a lot of awards. Um, in 2001, in fact, from 2001 up to 2006, Ecobank Ghana was actually the best bank mm. in Ghana mm. by Corporate Initiative of Ghana. You know, we also have won awards um, in advisory services. So, so what does it mean mm. to you when, when you go for these award ceremonies and Ecuba Ghana is, is mentioned in any category? I mean, how is the feeling like for the bank? I mean, we are so excited. It, it all goes to our clients mm. because it's a testimony of what we are doing and the fact that our clients are very happy because the feedback is received from the clients. Mm. And they say that, you know, this bank is good and this bank is the best. Mm. So once we just get that information, we are so happy that our clients are very happy with us. But so what yeah. makes the bank tick if someone says, and then Echo Bank has stuck with pride. It's like there's something like there's some gold here at Echo Bank. What, what's so unique about Echo Bank Ghana? What's so unique about it? It's the culture. It's a family, mm. you know, and where everybody is important. You would even realize that, I mean, we wear the same attire, so nobody knows if this is a junior staff or a senior <laughs> staff, so we all are very comfortable. We call people by their first names, and then... Oh, so how do you call your group CEO? Just Albert? Yes, we call him Albert. Mm. You know, everybody calls him Albert, you know. And I think also the key driving principle, so to say, the core values, um, have gone a very long way to help us mm. because... Every staff member has imbibed the core mm -hmm. values, mm -hmm. you know, so we are being driven by the core values mm -hmm. of the bank. Mm -hmm. The first one is to focus on the customer. Mm -hmm. We believe the customer is very, very important. I mean, so whatever we do should revolve you, do you, around Do you customer. focus on the poor customers to get the rich ones? We, re we focus <laughs> on all our customers. I know. <laughs> <laughs> and we are supposed to do the right thing, you know, towards our customers, mm -hmm. to our colleagues to anybody we come into contact mm -hmm, with. Mm -hmm. So ideally everybody has in mind to do the right thing. It's one thing that is seriously driving us. Mm -hmm. And we want to keep it simple. You know, everything we do should be very simple. The kind of English we write should be very simple. Our dressing should be simple, you know. And then we have to be very open. We are very open to one another, we say the truth to our customers. And then also, every staff member is supposed to be a leader. It's one thing that is driving everybody in Ecobank. Mm. Whatever assignment you have on your table, see yourself as a leader, and you ensure you execute it before you leave. Mm. So, I mean, these are some of the core values that have driven us mm -hmm. and brought us thus far. So tell us about the awards you know you've had so far. How many so far? Um, quite a good number. Oh. Um, in two thousand and one, mm -hmm. we won the best bank of the year award mm -hmm. by the corporate initiative of Ghana. We won the best bank in customer service, mm -hmm. and then we won we won the best bank in advisory services. Mm -hmm. You know, in two thousand and two, we also won the best bank of the year award. And we won the best bank in trade finance, also in 2002. And then in 2003, we still won the best bank of the year award. Oh. Best bank in um, IT and electronic infrastructure. 
and then also the CIMG award, mm -hmm. you know, we also won the best bank of mm -hmm. the year. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's been so in 2004, we also won the same award. We won the best, best bank. bank of the year. We won the best bank of the year. And then also best bank in IT infrastructure. So best, how many, how many best bank of the year have you got from, so from far? From 2001 to 2006, Ooh. you know, we won the best Six bank years of the in year. the row. Six years in the row. I mean, and 2007, in why? In 2007 uh -huh. also, we won the best bank in retail banking. Why not the year? What happened? Best, what changed? <laughs> Why not the best bank of the year? Well, nothing really changed, you mm. know, but, uh, well. You have to give it to someone yes. else. <laughs> <laughs> I hear you. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, I mean, that, 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 that has been the story. We, we've been winning one award after the other. Mm. And we are very encouraged by it because um, it's, it's an illustration and um, a testament from our clients that they are very happy with what we are doing. Mm. And that is the joy we have, and we'll continue to do that. So it's like they have an Ecobank experience. There is something or some air around here which is so natural and so nice and it's so comfortable for people to come in. That's true, yes? Yes, absolutely. Mm. Because we want to make sure that every customer that leaves the institution has the positive experience mm. of the services he or she came, I mean, to, to, to ask for. We'll be right back. Do stay on. The Hard Truth Season 8 with Akosia Konedu. Proudly brought to you by Echo Bank. At Echo Bank, we see a great future. One that's full of opportunity. For those who want to be the best. With over 1,000 branches of a single bank across 33 African countries. It's a future where trade can flourish without boundaries. The future is breathtaking, with enormous cross-border investments helping business and government build new infrastructure while individuals achieve their ambitions right across Africa. The future is Pan-African, and EcoBank is the Pan-African Bank. Welcome back, and you're still watching The Hard Truth, and we are currently at the uh, EcoBank head office, and uh, Mrs. or Reverend Mrs. Patricia <laughs> Sapo, head of uh, corporate communication, is still here. Patricia, CSR. Yes. What, what, what has Ecobank done that, you know, the public or the Ghanaian public should be proud of? Um, I think we've done so much in line with our, our um, vision mm. of contributing to the economic development of Africa. Right. Um, we, we have a corporate social responsibility, you know, of supporting various institutions. Um, we... Our focus areas are health, education, the underprivileged, mm. and also job creation. Mm. You know. Education, it's, uh, I really like education. What have you done in that sector? Oh, we, we, have, done, we have done quite a lot. We have sponsored, um, for instance, in Fansman Girls School. Mm. We have sponsored them. Well, in the, what? The, what did you do for them? The, um, Facilities for their new graduates, you know, um, mm -hmm. complex, building complex. Mm -hmm. We have done that. We have also sponsored quite a good number of the medical students, mm. you know, on their exchange programs. Mm. We have done that also. And then also um, St. Michael's um, Junior High School mm -hmm. in Pando. Um, their school building was so much... Um, um, dilapidated. Dilapidated. And so we just took it upon ourselves to refurbish mm. um, the That's school cool. that has been done. We are currently been buying furniture for them mm. to furnish, you know, um, um, the classrooms. Yes, I mean, I, I was talking to uh, Mr. Ken Kanda and he was so passionate about, you know, the, the, the school, the Pando, yes, Pando, Pando St. St. Michael's. Michael's and yes. uh, that's what he had to say. The school had totally run down. The roof was in a pretty bad shape. 
mercifully, Sam just said, Ken, we can help you. The bank can help the school. And now they have totally rehabilitated the school. I should show you pictures of the school as it was and how it is now. It's looking real splendid. Sam has further promised to help me furnish the school, which is now work in progress. I thank Ecobank for this wonderful assistance. Ken, Ken was talking about how you know he spoke to Sam and then it was just fixed like that. So do you do that to the others or are you going to do that to um, some other schools who need help? Where the need arises. You, you would do it. We will do it because we saw because the from state. the state, yes. I yes. mean, looking at it from the state of it to what is yes. I think Ecobank has really done well. Yes. Kudos we, to you we, guys. We saw done the state and so well. so we mm. just couldn't just hold back. Mm. We mm. just couldn't hold and back. And then he, so he's he saying that it. you are going to finish too. Yes. Oh. Yeah. The John said um, fire, blood, disaster. Mm. We also made a donation, close to 100,000 Ghana cities to the 37 military hospital. Mm. You know, there we see a lot of victims there. Yes. Mm. Yeah, yeah. So that's also part of our contribution. Mm -hmm. Not forgetting Kolibu Teaching Hospital, we have bought a huge x ray machine, you know, which we also service every year. Um, you'll recall that early part of the year, we partnered with MTN and we were able to get um, 1,000 pints of blood, mm, mm. you know, that we distributed mm -hmm. to the various um, hospitals. Mm -hmm. And then also we, we sponsored one cancer patient, you know, for cancer treatment that was very expensive. Mm. Um, we also supported the Children's Heart Foundation where we um, sponsored for the surgery of two um, heart patients. I mm. mean, is it like someone monitoring going around from a Kuban going around to monitor just putting the money in there? Once a while we follow up. For instance, on the two children, the surgery will be done. Once the surgery is done, we'll follow up on to see how they are doing. Mm. If there's any other help we can give, we will give mm -hmm. to them. For the Kwando School, um, we are looking at commissioning it sometime next week. And I believe that after that, occasionally, we will just um, visit them. Yeah. Where there is a need to even identify very brilliant, yet underprivileged ones in the school, we will support them financially, mm. even through the school and hopefully to invest in. So parents out there listening right now, I mean, if someone is not really in a good financial state to perhaps take care of their wards to school and all that, yet they are brilliant students, but poor, as you said, can they walk to Echo Bank office? Well, what can they do? What was the process? Um, normally, mm -hmm. um, for instance, if a school approaches us, you know, and indicates that, you know, these children will need support and our budget can accommodate, so we will. But to have individuals coming in, you can just imagine the queue mm. that will be in the So bag. they should channel it through the school? Through the school. <laughs> and then let, let's talk about convenience and all. You, you, you mentioned that initially, you know, banking in the mission of vision, you mentioned something about convenience. What is it? What, what, what do customers get convenient on? Oh, well, um, like I said, our, our mission is to provide our customers services that are convenient, mm. accessible, and reliable. Mm. And what I just mean by convenience is uh, making it easy for them to transact business with Ecobank, mm -hmm. where in their own time, anywhere, they can still transact business mm. with the Kubai. I think one of the amazing things that I've, I find fascinating is your credit card. Yeah. Because some other banks don't. I yes, mean, no yes. offense to any bank, but personally, yes. I think that's, that's really a good thing. Yeah, we were the first bank to introduce credit card in Ghana. Oh, amazing. Yeah. Amazing. Yeah. amazing. Mm. You know, so, and, and we have our, we have a 24-7 call center. And oh. Yes. Oh. On 24-7 basis, the number is 3225. Mm. 
anywhere you are. Three two two five. Three two two five. So if I call a three two two five, someone will pick up now. Immediately. Mm. Immediately. Okay. You know, and then answer any question. So before the show ends, I'll try and make that call to see if someone picks up. Okay. Yes, I'll okay. do that. I'll be very glad. <laughs> So the number to call uh, if you are in trouble or if you want assistance from Echo Bank is 3225. 3225. 3225. 3225. Okay. Mm. You know. So we have that. And then we also have our e-alert. I mean, anytime you transact business, it will show on your phone. And then also we have our internet banking. I mean, I think that's the future, internet banking. Even on your phone, you have access to internet. You can just look at your balance you can just transfer money yeah. so that is also very very available you we have our atm cards you know wherever you are on any visa branded you know atm you can transact you know business in fact recently we have even entered into partnership with mastercard so very soon you see uh, mastercard around let's talk about smes and the competitive advantage you have on on uh you know small medium scale businesses so what, what what is that um the smes um is it's, it's a it's an area that we are very much interested in and we have a lot of products that um have been developed for them we are very much aware of the fact that they have a lot of contracts here and there. Yeah. So we have what we call the contract financing. Mm. You know, if you have a contract and it's with a very good institution, I mean, a credible institution, mm -hmm. let's say like a Unilever, a Fan Milk, you know, we know that we can verify. So for that, once you have a contract, you have to supply some sort of whatever. We will we'll give you the facility, mm. okay. We also have um, receivables back financing. Mm. You might have supplied the items awaiting payments. Mm. Okay, pending that, once we look at the documents and we verify, we would also give you monies against your receivables. Unilever and then the company you mentioned, they are a huge, big company. <laughs> so what if someone says, hey, my company is nowhere near Unilever and then I need a facility from EcoBank, how does it work? You, you, you see, for, for that facility, you should have supplied to an institution that we are very sure will pay you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Because we write on the track record of that institution mm. to give you the facility. Mm. Okay. But if it's a very small um, um, company and you need a facility, there are other um, facilities that are available. I so, hear people say that I went to bank SOZ and then it was stressful and I didn't get the bank loan. In applying for a bank loan at Echo Bank, is it easy to get here? If we look at the viability of the business, we look at your cash flows and we look at your ability to pay and we think you can pay, you know, the principal and the interest will be willing to give you. Of course, you need to have a fallback to, you know, security just in case something goes wrong, what do we do? So we take all those things into consideration. Some, some institutions or financial institutions brand themselves, loan in less than 48 hours, loan in less than two hours. Ecobank is loaning just that less than what? For most of our products or loans to the SMEs, mm -hmm. our turnaround time is 24 hours. Mm -hmm. Oh. And we, we, we don't really ask for your financials as in go and bring your balance sheet, mm. go and bring your p &L, So it's just loan in less than, in 24, less than 24 hours. hours we just, you just complete a one sheet of paper. We just, it's a checklist. We just check. Once you just qualify, we just give it to you. We'll be right back. The Hard Truth Season 8 with Akosia Konedu. Proudly brought to you by Ecobank. Bank, we see a great future, one that's full of opportunity for those who want to be the best. With over 1,000 branches of a single bank across 33 African countries, it's a future where trade can flourish without boundaries. The future is breathtaking, 
with enormous cross-border investments helping business and government build new infrastructure. While individuals achieve their ambitions right across Africa. The future is Pan-African and Ecobank is the Pan-African Bank. Welcome back and you're still watching The Hard Truth and uh, Patricia Sapo is my guest. Patricia, Ecobank Day, tell <laughs> us, what is Ecobank Day? Well, what's that? What goes into Ecobank Day? It's part of our CSR activities mm. and all over the group, in all the 36, you know, um, affiliates, we have assigned the first Saturday of every October mm. and we embark on a health-related project, you know, for the country in which Ecobank is. Very good. Okay. Do Last year we, we did malaria. Okay. You know, and we were in all the regional hospitals in, in Ghana. Mm. And we helped clean the area and then we gave donations, mm. various donations for the prevention of malaria mm. to the hospital. Should we trust that the prospect of Ecobank, I mean, what is it? Is it going to be okay? Is it going to be better? <laughs> Is it going to be like super bright? Tell us about the prospect. Being a preacher woman, I would say that he who has begun this good work with Ego Bank will finish it. Mm. So based on that, we are very confident about the future. That God who has brought us this far will, will keep us mm. in the future. Mm. So I'll say the future is very bright. Mm -hmm. I mean, if within all these years we are, we are the largest bank, mm. then of course, we just have to keep moving on. And our customers have great confidence in us. And we continue to improve on our services by the day. Mm -hmm. So we can only be better than we are now. So the future is extremely bright by God's grace. Right. Now, Reverend Mrs. Patricia Sapo, my guest here, launched a book on the 18th of July and it's titled The Christian Woman. <laughs> Tell us about this book. This is your first to come guess. Yes, that's my maiden book. Listen, yes, tell us about it. Well, the book is, is about, it's for everybody, mm -hmm. but the focus is on women, but mm -hmm. it's very beneficial to everybody. Yes, and it says the secrets to enjoying your marriage. Yes. Oh, <laughs> is it a personal experience? Why this book? Well, why I, the book? I, yes, the, the, why this book? Because God just laid it on my heart. Mm -hmm. I. I felt a lot of women were going through a lot of challenges in their marriage lives. And I mean, I had learned certain things in my marriage, which I thought was very necessary by the leadings of the Holy Spirit mm. to share it with Can women. you share just one with everyone in Ghana now? Oh, what, well, what exactly did you go through? I think it's just about submission. And you should be, we should be very forgiven. I've, I've just realized that as women, we are emotional beings. Mm -hmm. And most times we focus more on the negative side of our husbands mm -hmm. without looking at the positive sides. Mm -hmm. But if we could step back a little bit, you know, we will be more forgiving, mm -hmm. we will be more tolerant right. with them. Mm -hmm. And it, it also talks about prayer. A prayer? And Yes, and also managing your, your own finances. Mm -hmm talks a little bit about financial empowerment. Mm. I just got mine actually and I read 10 lines. I'm like, I'll have to finish this book today. It's going for 20 Ghana cities and it's the Christian woman's secrets to enjoying your marriage. And I, I know we all want to enjoy our marriage. You don't want divorce because God, the Bible says, well, God <laughs> hates divorce. So you can get the book at uh, Maximat, across board, uh, Challenge Bookshop, Hukum Lemle, uh, Koala, Frankie's, uh, Dominion, Action Church, the yes. Yale Bookshop and all. Finally, what should Ghana expect from Ecobank Ghana 2015? Oh. We are in July, but what should we expect from oh. the bank? You see, Ecobank is here to serve our customers mm. and we are very committed to it. Mm. So our clients should continue to expect good services and even enhanced services. Right from Ecobank, mm. yes. Anyway, before we go, I promise I was going to check the helpline to see if it works. So you said the number to call is 3225. Two, two, so let's see if it truly works. And if you're in distress and you need some help with your bank, let's see. Welcome to Ecobank. Oh, it works. For quality assurance and security. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you, Reverend, for talking to the Thank heart. We're really so grateful much. to you. So I've been talking Thank to you. 
um, Reverend Mrs. Patricia Sapo, uh, Head Communications, uh, Kubangana, and uh, Mr. Ken Kanda, thank you so much for your time and uh, have a good evening. My name is Nana Akusia Kunedunda. Reflex Images, thank you, Valerie. Thank you. Bye. The Hard Truth Season 8 with Akosia Kunedu. Proudly brought to you by Echo Bank.